I mean, I love, obviously, Olivier as a person, but as a designer, I think he's so awesome. He always, like, brings a different element to the Fashion Week, and there's nothing like his pieces, so it's always awesome to be in the show, and I feel like I fall in love with a different part of every look, and it's really cool. Oh, last night? Yeah, <laughs> it was fun. It's gorgeous, everybody looks stunning. It's the Bellman Army. We all look like warriors of the Bellman Army. Very strong, confident, sexy women. Don't mess with us. I think, you know, I started my Bellman Army because I understood that my girls are more than models, they are soldiers. They are women that actually, when they are on my show, they are not just models, you know, they are not hangers. There are girls that actually express something that is stronger than the clothes. Olivier stands for, he stands for diversity, he's all about championing that always in his shows, in the collection he's showing women of all ethnicity. That's a strong thing to be a part of. To be women, strong, beautiful, powerful women. You definitely feel that when you're walking down the runway in these beautiful garments, you feel empowered. When I walk the show, I feel so powerful, so sexy in my own skin. You know, the way I look, I look good. I don't have to change anything to, you know, fit in or something. I'm brown, I look good, I have black eyes, black hair. And, you know, I feel like, yeah, I've been cherished for that. Personalities are really important. I think a lot of designers today forget that you talk to women. You don't talk to hangers, you know. You talk to girls that actually have power. So I think you need to feel it on the one way. And I think when I start to get my first critiques and just calling me like too much or whatever it is, I was just like, actually like, they are not models. They are defending more than just cl my clothes. They are defending my ideas. So I think to me, they were like more Amazon. They were like soldiers, warriors. And I was like, you know, we're gonna create an army of people that fight for their rules, fight for their identity and their ideas. And, and that's why we start with the Bauman Army and all my girls love it because they fight every day to be who they are and being respected for who they are and what they do. And I think fashion, they, we need to sometimes go into fights and revolution to make change. Look at me, I'm sparkling. I'm a part of the Bauman Army. It means you're part of empowering the whole, the strong female. There's something about, there's room for all of us, and it's really, really cool to be part of that. He really picks girls that he think have a strong look. He wants like beautiful, powerful women, and I think that that's the energy, the feeling that we get from him and from his clothes, from putting them on. It's just easy to go out there and, and work it, and that's why I love wearing his stuff, just slip it on and I already feel stronger. Bauman, it's all about uh, being strong, yet classy, you know, embracing femininity. So I feel grateful when I see designers like Olivier embracing the modern woman. I think fashion helps you to feel unique and special. And to me, if I'm honest and personal, I am come from nowhere. I'm adopted, I come from an orphanage. I don't know my parents, my biological parents. Um, but I think fashion helped me to build my identity in a way, to feel stronger, uh, more confident with myself. Um, and I think sometimes people take really lightly fashion. They should understand that fashion is not only clothes, it's sometimes an armure to fight against the world and sometimes fight against yourself. Try to find the, your own identity. And, and it helped me to grow up. And I think today, with my fashion, I help people to believe in themselves, being confident, feel powerful. And when you tell me my girls told you that they love it, it's because when they are on the runway, they feel more confident. And confidence, it's important in life.